mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you. I lift up your name to worship you once again. Thank you and glorify your name. You are a worthy God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. Welcome once again. This is your host, Prophetess Dr. Christine Isigi. Welcome you from Overcomers Deliverance and Healing Ministry, Brampton, Ontario, Canada. Welcome once again. I'm going to talk to you this chapter called Manifestation Power to Destroy Works of the Devil. Manifestation Power to Destroy the Works of the Devil. Manifestation Power to Destroy the Works of the Devil. I'm going to read from the book of 1 John 3 8. Thank you. The book of 1 John 3 8, which, which says, for this purpose, the Son of God was manifested that he might destroy the works of the devil. The purpose of God, the purpose of God, he sent his, his son, his only begotten uh, son, Jesus Christ, to come and destroy the powers of the devil, to come and destroy the works of the devil. Jesus Christ, he came to manifest manifested himself was manifested himself was fire brigade himself was power to destroy the works of the devil yes my god i want to thank you for the power to destroy even satanic dreams every evil dream that you have the power of god will manifest and destroy them in jesus name every demon in your in your life let it be manifest and, and, and start coming out now in Jesus' name. Because Jesus, uh, his, his purpose is manifest to destroy the works of the Lord, of, of, of the devil. Anything that is not from God, let Jesus manifest and destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. Let Jesus himself, because the Bible says that for this purpose, the Son of God was manifested, was manifested, manifested. To destroy the works of the devil. To destroy the works of the devil. He, Jesus, was manifested that he might destroy. He might destroy the works of the devil. Because that is his, his purpose to come here. To destroy and silence every plans of the devil. You would, you would be amused at how many people the devil has tormented and is still tormenting with the, with the shadows, with, with, with their things. You know, people are tormented at night when they go to sleep. The devil is tormenting people. The devil is giving people fear. Some people, they have fear. They can't even walk. They can't even enter into their car. They can't go anywhere. They want to stay in the house to be locked in. The devil has locked some people. The devil has put people in prison. Don't pray with the devil. That is why I'm coming this morning. To, be, to pray that God will set you free from the bondage. People are tormented. And still the devil is continually tormenting people. Many, many people, many of you, you know how you are being tormented by the devil. The fear that you have. That you cannot do anything. The way you scare, the way you can't you, you can't even talk to people because when you see anybody, you fear. You think they are against you. You fear that they, they, something is going to happen. You fear all the time. I am praying the, the I am praying that God, God will touch you, and Jesus who manifest, manifested to destroy the works of the devil is coming to destroy every works of the enemy, is coming to destroy every powers of witchcraft, is coming to destroy any evil, any occult, any witchcraft power that is operating in your life. That is Jesus. Jesus will destroy them. Jesus will destroy that sickness, that powers of sickness. That sickness has been putting you in bed for years and years. Jesus is going to break every bondage that, that, that has been binding you. Every gauge. Jesus is going to cut them to pieces in Jesus' name. Because that is his work. His work is to destroy. It destroy anything working against you. Therefore, people of God, that poverty you are in, Jesus Christ, the Son of God, is coming to destroy it. Is coming to destroy in Jesus' name. Let Jesus destroy every poverty in your life in the mighty name of Jesus. The problem you are facing right now, 
by the power in the blood of Jesus because Jesus will manifest and destroy it in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray that Jesus will come to you right now. You need Jesus to break every bondage, to break every curse, to destroy curses that has been blessed on you, to destroy every works of the enemy, every works of the devil. People are living in curses. I was talking yesterday about the curses. Still, you, may, you, you, you can be surprised how many people are in the bondage. And Jesus himself, he came to destroy the works of the devil. He did, not came to, he did not come to sit together with the devil and love with the devil. He came literally to destroy the works of the devil. Therefore, people of God, you have been tormented. You have been suffering. You have been, you have been attacked by witchcraft, by evil people. Jesus Christ is destroying them in the mighty name of Jesus. You may pray aggressive, aggressively to defeat them because we know that they do not have the final say on your life. They don't have the final say in your life. It is only God that has, has the final say. Uh, uh, but if you don't uh, bring God into the situation, he will be watching you. You will bring him in. You can take back what he has taken away from you, from you by, by, by violent. God is the final say. The devil has not say that, 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 that cancer is yours. God has not say. The devil can say cancer, you have cancer, but God has not say. Because God is the final say. God has not say that the sickness you have, it is from God. God has not said so. It is the devil who has said so. Every report, every satanic report that you have, you, you have in your hand, reports from the doctor, everything they are saying about you, they are not the final say. God is the final say. It is God who, have, who will say and God cannot say so. Any evil report you are getting, it is from the devil. It is not from God. God loves you and he gave his only begotten son to come and destroy the works of the devil, to come and destroy the enemy, to come and destroy that witchcraft, that messing you up, to come and destroy that, 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 that occult person who is messing your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, I thank you, Father. God, I, God I, I, I press your name, God. Let the edges of defeat begin to roost their hold over your life in Jesus' name. Let the edges of infirmity begin to roost their hold over your life in Jesus' name. Let the edges of demotion begin to lose their hold over your life in Jesus' name. Let the edges of demonic delay to begin to lose their hold over your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Let the edges of conviction begin to roost their hold over your life in Jesus' name. Let the edges of back Backwardness movement began to lose their hold over your life in Jesus' name. Let the wicked oppressors stumble and fail in every area of your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Let all the instruments of failure fashioned against your life receive the fire of God and be roasted in Jesus' name in the mighty name of Jesus. Let all satanic weapon of attacks fashioned against you and your family to receive the fire of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father, let all satanic reports that are against you against your life and, and, and receive the final the fire of God and burn to ashes and be roasted in the name of Jesus. Let all satanic records that are against you, every satanic record that is holding your record, let them receive fire of God and be roasted in Jesus' name. Every satanic uh, every set every satanic records that are holding your record that is against you against your life, against your family. Let them receive the fire of God and get them be roasted by fire of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Let all satanic satirize and the manipulation. Oh yes, Lord my Father. Let all satanic satirize and the cameras used to, used to monitor you and manipulate your life to receive the fire of God and be roasted in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord my Father. I cancel and destroy and bind and 
the certifier, all satanic satellites and the cameras used to monitor you and manipulate your life. Receive the fire of God and be roasted by fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, God, I thank you. Let all satanic remote controlling fashion against your life and, and your family. Receive and receive the fire of God and be roasted in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, I want to thank you, Father. I want to bless your name, God, because Jesus has come to destroy every manipulation, every evil, every gutter of Satan, every demonic people, anything that is working against you in the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, destroy that iniquity, destroy that infirmity, destroy that evil in Jesus' name. Yes, I want to thank God for that. Uh, we are, I'm going to read from an, another scripture from first from 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 Acts one verse fourteen. Acts one verse fourteen. The Bible says they all joined together constantly in prayer, along with the women Mary, the mother of Jesus, and with the, with the, with the, with his brothers. You know, the apostles joined together and they prayed. And they prayed together. They and women and Mary, the mother of Jesus, was among them praying, praying and saying, Yes, Lord, we, we, we will pray and destroy anything that has been working against our life and, and stopping us from ministering and stopping us from moving forward. After they prayed, the power of God fell upon them and they manifested the power of Jesus manifested in their life and they started preaching and praying and the signs and the wonders were following them. Let's look in the book of, of Acts 4, verse 29 to 31. Acts 4, verse 20, 29 to 31. The book of Acts 4, 29 to 31. The Bible says, Now, Lord, look their threatens and grant to your servants that with all your boldness they may speak your word by switching out your hand to heal and that signs and wonders may be done through the name of your holy servant jesus and when they had prayed they pressed their they, they pressed they blessed where they were assembled together were shaken and they were all filled with the holy spirit and they speak the word of god with boldness now here, they, they, they represent God. They represent their case to God. They said, now Lord, look on their threatens. Anybody threatening you. Any power that is threatening you. Any power that is uh, tormenting you. Let them be destroyed in Jesus' name. Let them be wasted and be rendered powerless in Jesus' name. Now you see, the apostles... After they received the power, after Jesus manifested in their life, now they represent the case to God and tell God, Lord, look at this enemy who is tormenting me. Look at this witchcraft who is attacking me. Look at these dreams that is uh, coming to me. I can't sleep. Look at this sleep, uh, 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 spirit husband that is coming to me every night. Every problem that you are facing, you go to God and say and, and tell God, look on their threaten, look on this sickness, look on this property, look on this financial break financial problem that I'm facing. Lord, my father, I come before you because I know the enemy has threatened me on, on, uh, in the area of finances. I'm challenging in finances. I am having a issues that God, I need divine help. I need you to help me. Lord, my father, in the name of Jesus, I know that God you will deliver me. Jesus, Jesus, you manifested, your, you manifested yourself to destroy the works of the devil. Destroy anything that is working against me. That is how you can talk to God. You talk to God. I am praying that God will destroy anybody, any power that is manipulating you, any power that is threatening you in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, God, my Father. I want to thank God and, and God is, is awesome God. Yes, you know, after the apostles they were able to pray and represent their case. They pressed their, they, the place where they were praying, they were shaken, they were shaken. 
Therefore, I pray that anything that is working against you, let it be shaken. Let it be shaken. Let it be shaken. Let it be shaken. Be shaken. Be shaken in Jesus' name. There is no power. There is power manifestation of power. There is power of God that will destroy anything that is not from God in Jesus' name. Because the Bible says Jesus, Jesus himself, the son of God, is a destroyer. He came to make sure that anything of the devil is not working against you. Anything of the devil does not work. That's the work of God. That's the work of Jesus. Jesus came to destroy that anything operating with the devil does not work on you. Let Jesus destroy them. Let Jesus de destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. Let Jesus destroy anything working against you, working against your family, working against your children, that your children that are giving you problem, you are faced with their uh, problem, you are faced with the issues, husband, wife, children, finances, uh, you, uh, you are almost home, 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 you are home, homeless, you are home, almost homeless, you have no way to turn to, you are living in people's house. I pray that God would destroy that situation. Let Jesus destroy the situation that you are facing. You might be asking people, today you are thinking, where am I going to sleep? You call somebody to give you a commendation and you are a child of God. Let everything that's making you, that's making you like that, let them die. In the mighty name of Jesus, we, we are. I'm going to look, to pray to, to read another scripture from the book of Psalm 77, verse 1. 77, uh, the, the book of Psalm 77, verse 13, 14, verse 13 to, to 15. Yes, the book of Psalms 77, verse 13 to 15. The Bible says, Oh God, your ways are holy. Is there any God in my, as might as you? His, his, his ways, the ways of God is holy. Is there any God as a might as you? There is no any other God a might like our God. There is no any God. It's the only God we have. You are a God of great wonders. God is a God of great wonders. You demonstrate your awesome power among the nations but you are strong arm you redeem your people and you redeem your people the descendant of jacob and joseph you know here god is god is is god god is a great power god do wonders god do miracles god is a god of miracles god is a god of wonder miracles and signs I pray that let God give you miracles. Let give you give give you signs and wonders. Let God give you the miracles. Come out from where you are. That business that is frozen. That business that you are almost to close. You have no customers. You open the the the, the business. The the hamburger. They place the hamburger on your business. You can't sell. You can't do anything. You have everything. But other people are selling selling. But you. And they go to the chamber and go. You you do this, nothing is happening. Let the power of signs and wonders fall upon you. Let the power of Jesus that came to destroy the work of the enemy, destroy every enemy that is working against your business, that is working against your job, that is working against your children. In the mighty name of Jesus, I plead the blood of Jesus. Yes, God, my Father, I am going to pray by the power in the blood of Jesus. I pray yokes buried in your body. Be uprooted by the blood of Jesus. I am praying every yoke, every yoke buried in your body to yoke you, to destroy you. Be uprooted by the blood of Jesus. Let every yoke buried, you know, you can be you hooked with the, with the yokes so you can't move. The yokes of, of the devil, the devil can control you. You have no power. You become powerless. Even prayer, it is struggling. You struggle with prayer. You can't be able to read the Bible. The moment you go to read the Bible, the yokes will start bullying you. And then when you start, you get the distraction. You feel like you are, you are sick. Anytime you go to prayer, anytime you want to read the Bible, you, you, you struggle so much. Those yokes, I break them. I destroy them. I bind them. I set them fire. Every yokes buried in your body. I command them to cut fire. Be uprooted by the blood of Jesus. Be uprooted by the blood of Jesus. Let every yoke 
that is buried in you, that is you yoking you, let it be cut into pieces in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh God, make let let God make your enemies like a wheel, they stumble before the wind in the mighty name of Jesus. Let God make your enemies like a wheel as they stumble before the wind in Jesus' name. In in the mighty name of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus. I pray that God, in the mighty name of Jesus, I pray that I reverse the effect of every witchcraft summoning your spirit in the mighty name of Jesus. Every witchcraft summoning your spirit, calling your name for evil, monitoring you, using satanic mirror, I am reversing everything they are doing against you. This is spiritual warfare. Many people have no idea, and this is true, what the wicked are doing. You, you, you might be surprised. You, you might be surprised. The wicked, what they do. I am reversing their curses. I'm reversing their power. I'm reversing their ways. They are operating to, to summon your spirit in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, persecute. Let God persecute, persecute your enemies. Let God, let God persecute your enemies with the tempest and make them afraid with the storm in the mighty name of Jesus. The enemy. The Bible says that the, the, the enemy fly before 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 nobody's chasing them. The wicked would fly before you and nobody's chasing them in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, I pray that God will make your enemy to fly away before you in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, yes, every witchcraft identification mark be wept up by the blood of Jesus. Wept every satanic identification mark. When satanic identification mark marked you, wherever you go, this mark will show them you are there. It's like USB. It's like USB, not USB. It's like GSP. It's, how do you call it? That, that thing that people are using to, to go anywhere with this. With it. GPS. Yes, GPS. It is like GPS. I'm telling you, that when they mark you, when they put a mark on you, GPS of witchcraft will monitor you wherever you are. You can be anywhere in the world, but still, they are watching you. They know they operate you. They control you. I am praying by the power and the blood of Jesus. Every mark, every mark that they are using to monitor you, they are using to mark you, they are using to see you. Let it be cut fire. Let it burn to ashes. Let it be destroyed. Let it be destroyed in Jesus' name. I break them. I command them to cut fire. I remove that mark. Wipe it by the blood of Jesus. Wipe that mark in Jesus' name. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let that mark catch fire and burn to ashes in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, let the enemies be confounded and troubled. Let the enemies, let the enemies, God Almighty, let your enemies be confounded and troubled because Jesus has come to destroy their works. There is no way you can say that Jesus is, is he loves the enemy. Jesus does not love the enemy. If Jesus loves the enemy, then the scripture which we were reading that he came to manifest to destroy the works of the devil, then he, he, that scripture could not be there because Jesus himself is the enemy of the enemies. He came to destroy anything the devil is working against you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, I am praying that God will frustrate every witchcraft exchange of your vouchers. Every witchcraft working against you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let God frustrate them. Anything they are doing, it is not going to manifest in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father. I want to thank you, Lord. I pray that anything planted in your life by witchcraft, I command them to come out now. To come out now. Anything planted in your life by witchcraft, I command them to come out but now, now, now. To come out. The food you have been fed while you are sleeping. The food you have been eating, even physical. You may go to the restaurant. And this restaurant has dedicated to the demons, are dedicated to witchcraft. You eat unconscious and they have, they have planted something in your body. Let it be destroyed. Let it be landed out. Let it come out. Vomit it by fire. Vomit it by the blood of Jesus. Let it come down. Let it change. come out of, of your, your body. Let it come out of your body. 
everything that has been planted in your body through any method, through food, through dreams, through sex, through, through, through initiation, let it come out in Jesus' name. You can sleep with a demonic person, and this demonic person will destroy your life. You think that it's, it's fun, it's good, but it's not good. He has been assigned by the enemy to destroy your life. The moment you sleep with that person, that is when you are, every time everything turns against you. And you have no idea because you want to make him happy or you decided to do to, to, to test Th that's how it is but because of ignorance many people are perishing because of lack of knowledge yeah so this demonic woman or demonic person a man who comes to you love you he will put something for you the rest of your life you will regret you will cry you will cry and it will be very painful but Jesus the son of God will destroy it from now you have to be careful be really be careful because the agents of the the devil agents of satan occultic people they are using men and women to destroy lives of people they are using children to destroy even grown up so we we don't take things for granted you have to be careful you have really to be careful because there's some evil planted by the enemy they want to destroy the life of people. If they cannot catch you, like they know you can't drink, you can't go to the bar, you, you can't steal, they have other methods to destroy your life. The things they know you can't do, they don't, they don't attempt it with you. They come with something that you take rightly, you take granted. You have to be careful. Anything planted in your life by witchcraft, I command them to come out now in the mighty name of Jesus. I break down the gates of the wicked and bring their stronghold to run in the name of Jesus. I break every gate. I break every I break down every gate of the wicked and bring their stronghold to run in the name of Jesus. I break every gate of Satan. I break every gate of the devil. I break every gate of the enemy. The stronghold. I break them. I break them in the mighty name of Jesus. You, you shall not. You shall not be afraid of the terror by the night, nor for the sparrow that fly by the day in the mighty name of Jesus. You shall not be afraid. You, you know some people, as I mentioned before, they are so afraid. They fear, they are terrified. But the Bible says, you shall not be afraid of the terror by night or the arrows that fly by the day in Jesus' name. You shall not be afraid. We arrest every arrows that is flying on uh, during the day, that is flying during the night. You are arresting them. Let them be arrested. Let them be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Let, the step, let, let each step taken by witchcraft against you, lead them to great destruction in the mighty name of Jesus. Let each step taken by witchcraft against you to read, to read them to great destruction. These steps, the witchcraft are taking against you. Let them, let the, let it, let it, let them be read them to destruction, to great destruction in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, my God, thank you, Father. A thousand shall fall at your side and ten thousand at your right hand, but it shall not come near you in the mighty name of Jesus. Psalms 91. A thousand shall fall at your side and ten thousand at your right hand, but it shall not come near you in the mighty name of Jesus. The problem you are facing, there can be so many problems. There can be a rot going, not going on right now, but it will not come near you. It will come, but it will go. It will come, but it will go. It will come, but it will go. But don't, don't, don't be afraid. Don't fear them. Stand firm. Rebuke them. Cast them. Break them. Because remember, Jesus has destroyed them. So the Bible says, it, they shall not come near you. They shall not come you. They, they shall not come near you in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I command your environment to be son, to be none son, none no 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 flying son of witchcraft beds in your life in Jesus' name. I command your environmental environment, no son, no, no flying son, no flying son, no flying son of evil birds, no flying son of witchcraft in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father, I want to thank you, Jesus. Yes, your eyes shall see your desire on your enemies. Your eyes shall see the desire of your enemies 
in the mighty name of Jesus. Your eyes will receive the desire of your enemies in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I cut off the roots of witchcraft in the water. The roots of witchcraft in the water. I cut them off. I cut them off. I, I cut them off. Any witchcraft using water against you, speaking against you, attacking you from the water, let them cut fire. Let them be destroyed. Let them be rendered powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. Let that water dry. In the mighty name of Jesus. If you are seeing yourself swimming in the water, walking in the water, you are not a fish. Therefore, I am I am now taking a step of faith and command that water to be dried up in the mighty name of Jesus. Let the blood of Jesus dry up that water in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, my God. I pray let the let God lock every enemy that is resting up against you in Jesus' name. The power that troubled the Egyptians. Troubled, let it trouble the let it trouble your enemies in the mighty name of Jesus. The power that troubled the Egyptians, let them let trouble the, let, the, let them trouble your enemies in the name of Jesus. Anything deposited in your life by marine witchcraft, I command them to come out. I command them to come out. There are you people, some people, there are some things that are deposited in to your life by marine witchcraft. Therefore, I command them to come out. Every marine witchcraft, anything deposited in your life by marine witchcraft, let them come out. Marine witchcraft, they are the, they are responsible especially for marriages. They can make sure that you will not, not be married. They are very cherished and they don't want anybody. When marine, mar, marine power is operating in your life, your life does not want anybody. They want themselves. And nobody will love you. Nobody will like you. They are they are very cherished. They don't want. They want them to occupy them themselves. And they, you can't have money. You can't have children. They are operating, and they are, they are, their their mission is to destroy and kill. When they see anybody coming to you, they will make sure they are kill that person or destroy the person. Therefore, I I pray that every marine spirit, anything deposited in you in you in your life by marine spirit by marine water let them destroyed in jesus name by marine witchcraft let them be destroyed in jesus name yes thank you jesus you need to call me for deliverance i will be doing individual one-on-one -on -one deliverance we wanted to do yesterday but i canceled because it is not going to work Call me for you if you need me to pray for you to break and cast out to deliver the, the, for deliverance. Call me in the mighty name of Jesus. I'm giving you my number to call me, and I will schedule you before the end of this year. And those who want to me to do to, to raise up their altar, you, you also you need to call me in Jesus' name. Our number, if you have known, if you don't have our number, is nine zero five seven nine three seven nine eight. This is the number you can call me and if you need a deliverance. This marine spirit is very dangerous. Marine witchcraft is the very cherished marine demons that is operating by witchcraft. Especially people who are living in Caribbean uh, highlands of, uh, 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 near the lake, near the sea, near the levers. Those are the, they, they use them so much. They use them to attack you, attack everything you have. I pray that, oh God, my Father, in the name of Jesus, anything deposited in your life by household witchcraft, I command them to come out. Let anything planted, planted deposited in your life by household witchcraft, I command them to come out in the mighty name of Jesus. The wicked shall be graved and the easy desire shall perish in the mighty name of Jesus. The wicked will grave, the wicked will cry, and their desire will be perished. When they are desire to destroy you, to destroy your children, they will cry. They will not achieve. They will not succeed in Jesus' name. Let the rivers of your enemies be turned to the wilderness in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my God, my Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I come against every form of barrenness, every form of barrenness in your life, any form, any form of barrenness, barrenness in your life, I destroy them, I bind them. In the mighty name of Jesus, through God you shall do vanity, for it is He that tread down your enemies. In the mighty name of Jesus, yes, Lord, my Father, I want to thank God. God, let all those who console the dark darkness 
against you be disgraced in the name of Jesus. Let every witchcraft consoling darkness against you, let them catch fire, let them be destroyed. You know there's evil people who are consulting dark powers against you. Let them be destroyed. Let them be rendered powerless. Let them be rendered powerless. Oh Lord, set a wicked man over the wicked in Jesus' name. Let God set a wicked man over the wicked in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let God set a wicked man over the wicked and destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father, I want to thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Rapapapa shakarabakuria. Rapapapa shokorabakuria. Rapapapa shatororabakuraba. Yes, Lord, my God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I want to thank you. Jesus, I want to honor you. The Lord is on your side. You will not fear what can a man do to you in the mighty name of Jesus. Let the days of your enemy be cut off and let another take his office in the mighty name of Jesus. You, the son, the, the son, you the sun powers of break uh, breakthrough darkness give the give give let it give you a breakthrough power in the name of jesus yes lord my father i want to thank you jesus i want to bless your name hallelujah praise be the name of jesus oh god arise and roll your stone away in jesus name in the mighty name of jesus angels of prophecy Take your position in your life. Take your position. Angels of, uh, uh, pro uh, angels of prophecy, take your position in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father. Glorious God, I thank you. Every strange voices, and I, uh, every strange, every, every strange voices, I announce you are announcing your dominion in your life in Jesus' name. Every strange voices. We announce your dominion in the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, my Father. Yes, Lord, I want to thank you. I want to thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, God, arise and smite your infirmity. Let God arise and smite your infirmity. Smite your infirmity. Smite your sickness. Smite your sickness, your pain, in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, thank you. Fire in the name of Jesus. Arise and lock your vengeance in the mighty name of Jesus. Everywhere you turn, others shall salute you in Jesus' name. No, your blood shall not be found on any altar in the name of Jesus. Your blood shall not be found by any altar, any satanic altar in the mighty name of Jesus. Your blood will not be found by any satanic altar, any witchcraft altar. Your soul will not answer, your soul will not answer unto dark powers in the name of Jesus. Yokes, uh, curses, enchantment, break away from, I, I break them, I break them, I break them, I break them, I break them. Yokes, curses, enchantment, break in the mighty name of Jesus. Break break in the mighty name of jesus everybody used to as instrument against your life i command them to die any part any every bad used as an instrument against your life die die in the name of jesus die in the name of jesus yokes buried in your blood be uprooted by the blood of jesus thou evil son overshadowing your star clear away in jesus name powers troubling your dreams God shall trouble you today. Every powers troubling your dreams, the Lord will trouble them. The Lord will destroy them. The Lord will cut them off in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father, I want to thank you. Every curses with long legs in your family die in the name of Jesus. Every curses with long legs, with long hands, they like to curse you. Let them be, die. let them die in Jesus' name. Your enemies, your problem are over in the name of Jesus. Your problem, yes, your problems, your enemies are over. It is now your turn. Therefore, carry your rod in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Every dark every darkness hanging on your family tree be broken in jesus name i command every darkness hanging on your family bloodline i command them to be break 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 in jesus name anointing to dis disgrace your enemies anointing to disgrace your enemies anointing to disgrace your problem fall upon you fall upon let it fall upon you in jesus name in the mighty name of jesus yokes of satanic delay break 
break, break, yokes of satanic delay. They are yokes of satanic delay. They, are, they want to delay you. They want to delay everything. Everything is delay. You can't get things easy. They will delay, delay, delay. Let them be destroyed. Let them be rendered powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. Any power falling asleep to harm you, you shall not wake up. Any power falling asleep to harm you, they will not wake up. They will die in the mighty name of Jesus. I break the coven of darkness by the harm of the fire of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Let the, the, let the, let the, let, let, let the coven, let the casket of darkness, let the casket, uh, yes, let the casket, let the dark ca ca uh, casket be broken by the fire of God in Jesus' name. Some people, some wicked, they go and put your name and you are, and, and they write on your name, they chant and they go and put the casket. While they are praying, all when they, somebody is dead, they are going to view the person, they are crying and around. Some of them they have handicap that they are weeping the dead person, and that is that's that's where they drop their something, the paper, or the that 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 clothes they are they are holding. And when the person is going to be buried, he will be buried with those things. So they bury everything with the dead person. Those are the wicked, the powers of the wicked. That's the powers of the witchcraft, and it works. Because they chant too much. They talk too much about you. They speak and t spend time to speak about your name and your children. And it works for you. Therefore, you destroy them. You destroy them. No powers of witchcraft will work against you. They will not prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, I thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Let let the seven spirit of God manifest in your life like, like the one in, in, in Isaiah 11 verse 2. Let the seven... Let the seven spirit of God manifest in your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Let the, the seven spirit of God manifest, manifest in your life, manifest in my, your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Every power that wants you to suffer what your parents suffered, die in the name of Jesus. Die in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my father. Every power that wants you to suffer what your parents suffered, die, die, die in the name of Jesus. You know there's powers that they want you to suffer what your parents went through. There's some wicked power, generational curses, generational bloodline that will follow you what your parents suffer and you also will suffer. It is not going to happen. I destroy them. I bind them. I curse them. I curse them. They will not stand. They will be defeated in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Every financial grave dug for you, scattered in the name of Jesus. Financial grave, die. Every grave, you know, they, they dig a grave and put your finances in the mighty name of Jesus. I command them to die, to be scattered in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my father, every financial grave dug for you. Scatter, 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 financial grave, scatter, financial grave, scatter, scatter in the name of Jesus. Be bound, be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Any problem association with the dead relative, die, 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 die. Any problem associated with the dead relative. You know, some people you see dead relative. You are not dead. You are not allowed to see dead relative because dead, dead people does not have anything to do with the living. Therefore, I cast them. I bind them. I destroy them. I command them to die in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father, in the name of Jesus, I want to thank you. I want to bless your name. I give you all the glory. Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, you are wonderful. You are worthy. Oh, Lord, my Father, I want to thank you. I want to bless your name. I give you the glory. Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, you are wonderful. You are what God, in the mighty name of Jesus. I command you, every plans of the enemy, chamber off, chamber over the plans of the enemy to kill you. Chamber out, chamber out, chamber out in the name of Jesus. Uh, fake doors opened by the enemy for you, close in Jesus' name. Every fake doors, every fake doors. You know, sometimes you've been looking for a job. You, we pray for you, you get a job. And then the enemy will bring fake doors, will bring fake jobs, a wrong job. Then you get this job because you are looking for a job, and the job is not for you. It is from it is not for you because you are looking for the job. You run straight. You get that job. I pray that God 
Go close that fake door. Go close that fake, uh, fake, fake job. Or a husband. You've been praying for a husband. You've been praying for a wife. And then they, the enemy, they, you know, the devil, they hear. When you are praying, they hear. That's why you use the fire of God, the blood of Jesus, to seal your prayers. When you say, my God, when you feel your prayers, seal them with the fire of God. Seal them with the blood of Jesus. All the prayers, you know, the devil has ears. They listen. And they know what you are praying. Now they will, they will, they will send their person, agent. Because you are desperately, you look for a, for a husband you want. Uh, I, I was praying with a lady. And this lady, she was desperately looking for a husband. To me, I told her, it's, your time is not up. Let's continue trusting God. Now, this woman, she, she felt like, uh, uh, I'm, not, I'm not doing anything. She didn't trust me what I was telling her. Now, she went ahead and met a, a man. And this man was handsome, was beautiful, was so good. Handsome, very, very good man looking. Nice. <laughs> very right skin, tall. Having a car has his own house here in Canada, not 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 outside Canada. And then my friend, this lady, she disappeared for me. She was she was really close to me. I didn't see her for a long time. After like two years, is when she found me. She sent me a text message, and she sent me email, telling me please call me. She gave me a number. I am in trouble. Call me. Then I said okay. I call you. I don't refuse to call people. Me, when I call some people, when I call them, they don't they don't want to talk to me because of their own 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 ways. Now I call the woman. When I call the woman, the woman was crying. She said, "Where are you?" I told her where I am. She said, "I want to come and see you." I tell her, "Come." And then she came all all the way to my house, and the woman was was showing me how the man. Fight the woman in a in a in a ham, a big mouth. The man fight the woman and 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 fight her and drink her blood. The man was sucking the blood of that woman here in Canada, not anywhere else. <laughs> so I told the woman, "This is vampire. This is witchcraft. Why did the man do this to you? Have you reported the man to police? You see, and then." And this, this woman, I told her, no, don't go. Your time is not up. Because she really wanted a man. She wanted to be married. And this man was engaging her. Before even they were going counseling to get married. Before the wedding, that, that's how the man turned against her. And to show her really who he is. So any fake thing that is coming before God is bringing his original, you know, let them die. In the mighty name of Jesus, any fake door, let it be destroyed. Let it catch fire. Let it be destroyed and lend a powerless in Jesus' name. Those fake doors, when you are looking for something, the fake doors will come and then you will take it. And that is the one which is going to destroy your life. Let it be closed by fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Storm of life, shut up by fire in the name of Jesus. Storm of life, shut up by fire in the name of Jesus. Every portion in your body, Die in the mighty name of Jesus. Every portion in your body, die. Anything that has been portioned to you, anything that is in portion to you in your body, let it die. Let it be furnished in Jesus' name. Yes, Lord, my Father, I want to thank you. I want to lift your name up. I thank you, Father. Lord Almighty, I see this prayer with the Holy Ghost fire. I see this prayer with the power of God. I see this prayer with the blood of Jesus. My Father and my God, all these prayers that we pray, no one will be used against anyone to attack them. In the mighty name of Jesus, glorious God, I want to thank you, Father. Let the fire of God cover this prayer. No demon will take this prayer to use against anyone in Jesus' name. Lord, I want to thank you. Lord, I want to bless you. Lord, I want to give you the glory. In the mighty name of Jesus, I commit your people into your hand. I cover them with the blood of Jesus. I throw a war fire around them, around their houses, around their family. In the mighty name of Jesus, my God and my Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I see this prayer with the precious blood in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. This is your host, Prophetess Dr. Christine Sigi saying bye-bye, bye-bye to you. See you tomorrow. The same time, 9 p.m. Uh, all 
9 p.m. Nine, see you today, tonight, tonight, 9 p.m. And tomorrow I will come off and um, mostly 9 or I will see the time I will come. So God bless you so much. Go to our website www.overcomersdhministry.blogspot.ca. You can reach me in the, our numbers. If you need prayers, you need deliverance, our number. Uh, uh, we have cell phone, we have landline, so it's, it's, you can use to call any, any of them. You, I, will, I will pick up and my secretary will pick up. Anybody can answer you and schedule you with the a, with a, with a, with a appointment to, for deliverance. Most of them, I am the one who is operating, so you don't have to worry. I will pick the phone and talk to you. Our number is 905-792-3798. That is a cell phone. If you want to text, write your uh, text me or WhatsApp me. If you want this, the the, the landline is 905-787-7196. We don't use 800 anymore because people they want free things free so they take advantage of everything let them pay let them also feel it because nothing free we give you free so you want you you you, you have to, you want everything to be free there are materials free there you can go and help yourself so the phone to call for 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 deliverance you have to pay you have to use your cell phone you have to use your landline or there is wi-fi you can use uh, WhatsApp to reach me in Jesus name. Thank you very much. God bless you. Have a wonderful time. Bye bye. Bye bye. I love you. I love you. And there's nothing I can do about it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I love you so much. And there's nothing I can do about it. Bye. <laughs> bye bye.